please confirm anyone are you visible to sc my screen right yes sir yeah okay so then we can continue our session to our uh, previous session so we completed these three points right so first of all the first very very important point is understanding all requirements Okay, thank you. So first of all, we understand the all the exact requirement, and the second point is, in case the requirement is not clear, then we can schedule one meeting to user. So mali meeting ella schedule se schooli and the ane the mali ne me ko practical session je pina puru na system na company laptop lo je pina puru ne me ko two pista no meeting ella schedule je schooli teams lo ani. Aur karna thele involved lonte. That the Zoom lo yalla schedule just call it and chop it down. And a very very important point is while we are working with any project, uh, one point in a chapter much paya. And the other, so we need to follow up with mails. And the meko while we are working in uh, real time, generally we are receiving some mails. And the so as a consultant, the main uh, responsibility is once you received any mail. From any user or your team lead or manager or whatever it is, you must and should respond to that mail. That's our main responsibility. Okay, and when it comes to announcement project, also we received some mails from the user or from the above or or from the our manager. So we need to respond those mails also. That is also one of the very important point. And the third one is whether this requirement is fulfilled with announcement or not. Okay, so we assume we received one announcement and we clear these three settings, and that is announcement is possible with SAP. Then we can go forward to next step. If it is not possible to SAP, then we can skip that announcement and we uh, we schedule one meeting with uh, our manager and the riser requester and requester manager also. we can uh, add uh, uh, those persons and in that meeting we need to explain why this is not possible and uh, what is the uh, criticality once we are implementing this announcement and uh, what are the time estimations or whatever it is so we need to explain very properly politely and we we can close that announcement as per the business confirmation so still the business is not uh, satisfied then we can give some other alternative solutions also okay we cannot give 100% solution at least we can give 60% 70% other alternative solutions also that's it so later the fourth step is first of all we can write the fsd fsd stands for functional specification document in your interview also your interviewer asking this question what do you mean by fsd so in your experience did you maintain any fsds in earlier and uh, which points we need to maintain in fsd and what is the importance of fsd and where you can get uh, that fsd in your earlier project so this type of questions adugutha untaru interviewer lo so usually while we are working in any project fsd we have already one template is there that template is vary from organization to organization the we have one design template fsd one design ms word template in that ms word template we need to maintain some details i will show you the real time fsd what earlier i maintained in in my earlier organization i will show you no problem okay so but uh, the thing is the first one is every organization will provide the template fsd deals and uh, this template fsd is they maintained their sharepoint folders companies sharepoint folder ekkada nunchi me receive cheskoval fsd ni we can get it we can download it from the sharepoint folders okay so that is also important next so i will show one fsd 
so this is the real time fsd earlier i worked uh, one organization so in that organization i maintained this fsd okay so usually the fsd will be looks like this so here they maintain functional specification so template version they maintain like this and this is the enhancement name so usually for every enhancement we maintained one name every enhancement we maintained one name hey, here the name is inter upload inter company postings and object id this is the very very important for every enhancement what do you mean by object id object id is nothing but this is id provided by the technical head of your organization technical head ante above lo unna evaraithe senior manager unnaro they will provide one object id in this object id only they will maintain their customized code so that is the importance of object id object id okay and this object id is usually provided by the technical senior managers so in that object id we they will maintain uh, the avapar will maintain customizing uh, code and uh, for example yesterday in that mundu session lo kuda oka doubt adigar enti ante if we are doing some enhancement in that enhancement again we can do some changes so in that case again we need to create new enhancement or or within existing enhancement it means within existing program within existing transaction code we can do our uh, uh, can we maintain our changes yes we can maintain no problem so within new enhancement we can maintain existing t code existing customizing t code existing uh, customizer program only we maintain our changes we maintain our new requirements so at the same time ikkada based on the object id only the technical people knows where this coding where this program are maintained in sap by seeing this one so that is the importance of object id so this is the fsd and here you can see table of contents overview session in overview we have document change history document sign off open items related rcf objects contact list and functional requirement this is the very very important as a functional consultant we need to maintain this one to be requirement to be requirement as is to be as is means present present as is nothing but present to be means business requirement what uh, the business uh, required the new things that is the to be requirement in earlier classes implementation project i showed earlier one excel file as is to be we have some uh under the ne sheets nen chupicha mi gadi undo ledo so as it is the same concept next so we have the table of contents like this all the details they maintain like this like enhancement details type of enhancement details description user interfaces required these are all the things we maintain okay and uh, this is the overview scenario like how our enhancement uh looks like like what is the enhancement name enhancement id what is the process area is it ap ar gl asset accounting what is that area which area we need to enhance this enhancement and what is the sub process general posting general posting while we are uh, posting generals we did this enhancement and what is the complexity is it uh, low medium high what is the complexity and uh, sap transaction this is the transaction to perform that enhancement so nen em cheppa for every enhancement we maintained one t code with starts with z z z z f i underscore inter upload this is the customizing t code for this enhancement next roll out information it means whether this enhancement is applicable to entire global or we can uh, enhance only specific country see while we are working with enhancements some of the enhancements we need to maintain globally it means we need to maintain our 
టోటల్ ఆర్గనైజేషన్ మళ్ళీ గ్లోబల్ కంట్రీ అంటే ఏంటి అని ఆలోచిస్తున్నారా ఆలోచిస్తారు ఏంటి అంటే వైల్ వీఆర్ వర్కింగ్ విత్ ఎనీ క్లయింట్ క్లయింట్ హ్యావ్ బిజినెస్ సో మెనీ కంట్రీస్ రైట్ ఫర్ ఎగ్జాంపుల్ ఇన్ ఎవర్ ఇన్ అవర్ కేస్ మై క్లయింట్ హ్యావింగ్ హ్యావ్ బిజినెస్ మోర్ దెన్ సెవెంటీ ప్లస్ కంట్రీస్ ఇన్ దట్ సెవెంటీ ప్లస్ కంట్రీస్ వీ హ్యావ్ డిఫరెంట్ డిఫరెంట్ కంపెనీ కోడ్స్ రైట్ సో వైల్ వీఆర్ పర్ఫార్మింగ్ దిస్ అనౌన్స్మెంట్ we need to implement for total 70 countries or are we need to implement only for one country or or are we need to implement for only one region region means asia africa tells kada australia kandal tells kada ne so ala so we need to tick mark okay so next frequency how this announcement are using once we are completing this announcement businesses are using uh, uh, how many times like when the business are using this announcement so daily they are using this one yes yeah so the frequency will be daily 15 days monthly quarterly hourly annually so whatever it is next so here you can see document uh, change history okay document change history so in this column we need to maintain for example so for same this uh, project for same this uh, uh, announcement earlier one of uh, some one person maintained some this announcement and right now we are changing this one so it means for every area so we need to perform multiple announcements the template will be same the template will be same so within this scenario we can implement uh, n number of announcements for example here we have two announcements right so the use, next time same this scenario the business wants one more uh, new announcement then again we can maintain here top so likewise we will maintain like this so here you can see my name and uh, we maintained uh, what is that and here the requirement add two additional validations to the test mode of this program okay so we will maintain this document change history that's it next this one is not required document sign off approved by is not required open items not required related rights of objects is also not required later we can go to functional requirements so in this functional requirement this is the very very important what i said earlier to be requirement it means by using this announcement what is the to be requirement after implementing this announcement in system uh, what is the system behavior what is the uh, business requirement this is the very very important step in fsd we maintained only three or four things we don't maintain total fsd we maintain only three or four things one is change history document history earlier i showed and the second one is this is the very very important and the third one is unit testing details you need to maintain we will maintain only four to five items fsd fill cheyatam ante chaala mandi adu ento annatu feel avutuntaru asalu ela fill cheyalano ekkada fill cheyalano asalu fsd atlu untado so ilante doubts untai general ga but it's very easy fsd write down fill cheyadam idantha kuda chaala easy once meer nechukunte next so ikkada nen maintain chesanu na changes modification by some my name and the description i maintain like this and brief understanding i will maintain like this and once i completed even here in this area i maintained screenshots also screenshots also uh, but uh, while i am copying i am unable to get my screenshots so that's the reason i am unable to show you and end my requirement is completed so likewise you will maintain in this area for example if the new announcement comes into picture simply you can go here and you will maintain like this modification so modification and tomorrow date today date what is the today date 22 so 12 2022 and you will maintain whatsoever uh, demand number slash demand number announcement number and you will maintain like this that's it it's very easy and to write a fsd is very easy
but uh, the thing is the thing is you need to 